Briefly on the developments that have affected our party once again, Action People's Party, APP River State. You will all recall that about a month ago, soon after our state party office was unveiled, by our national chairman and his team, same day, same night, the party secretariat was dynamited. We can authoritatively speak of the promptness of the Commissioner of Police in visiting the scene of the incident. But regrettably, we cannot speak of same concerning the outcome of the investigation regarding that incident. On last night, almost about the same time the place was dynamited, we also got a call between the hours of 11.30 to 12 a.m. in the night. That there was a gunshot that affected one of our gate men. As we speak now, he's receiving treatment in the hospital. The DPO Abacha Police Station has been here with his team. We made effort all through last night to get across to the police people that was stationed at the party secretariat for the safeguard of this secretariat and every party member. Regrettably, we couldn't reach the inspector who was in charge. We put call across for him severally. Up to now, he didn't return back my call. Rather, who returned back my call was one inspector Sunday who was in morning duty but left when his duty period expired to his home. It was the one that who picked our call last night and made efforts and briefed us so far what they thought transpired in this place. This is becoming an incident that has become too often in river state politics. We are not as part, like we said before, as to identify the immediate or remote cause of this incident. But we are believing that the police will carry out the investigation regarding this matter and as much as possible nip it in the board. It's not our desire that anybody should lose their lives becoming a member of our party. It's not our desire that any citizen of River State will lose his or her life because of politics. We only advise that all of us should play politics with fear of God in our hearts and even with money or power in our arms. There's nothing that's worth anyone's life. The fact remains that people must have different ideologies, people must belong to different political parties. That does not automatically make us...